So let's face facts. Are you a professional or are you an amateur? Let's go to the dictionary here. A professional is a person who is engaged in a specific activity as his or her main paid occupation rather than a pastime. Are you treating your business as a hobby or as a real business? Something where you can work from home, you have that freedom, you can make all the money you want. You cannot get away from sales and marketing. You've got to focus on it. You've got to have a system for leads that bring leads in. I call it virtual attraction. I do that through social media. I don't spend any money. I don't use virtual assistants. I do have some outside people who do follow up and scheduling for me, but I take care of my own marketing because the leads I get are high quality, not hundreds or thousands of garbage leads from some obscure mail list and then putting them into another system or hiring somebody else. I take responsibility for my business. This is my profession. My only goal is to speak to five people a day. I work at my profession every day. I work at my sales skills. All these videos that I've done for you guys all these years, um, we're almost approaching a thousand videos. Can you believe that? That's a lot of videos. Um, the thing about it is you got to work on your sales skills. Take my word for it, please. You're getting distracted by all the other stuff instead of the one thing that can make you money today. If you can speak to enough people, and if you can sound a little different, use those pattern interrupts, open up, use different openers. Hi, Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, sorry it took me so long to get back to you. I have your, uh, your note here, or I think it's just your phone number. You must have sold that property by now, right? Boom. Do different, approach people in different ways. Study sales, study marketing. Every, I read books on sales and marketing all the time. I listen to audio books every day. I listen to podcasts. I study other people who are successful, who are giving good phone. It really comes down to the sales. I mean, you can spend a lot of time in organization. You can spend a lot of time learning different strategies, going from one seminar to another and getting all walking on those hot coals and all that good stuff. You can then spend a lot of money on marketing and hire all these other people who, frankly, they do a half-assed job in my opinion. That's why I take responsibility for it myself. Do I work hard? Yeah, I work eight days a week, but I love it. I have passion for this business. It has given me a wonderful lifestyle. A great lifestyle. And all I do is get on the phone. I talk with nice people. I speak differently to them, though. I don't give them that, that garbage script, okay? I use that pattern interrupt. I learn how to ask questions with positive and negative redirection. I use a lot of different forms of psychology, which I've studied all the years. I have conditioned myself to look forward to these phone calls. I can make a cold call. I can make a warm call or a follow-up call. I will have fun. I will have a good time. I will not be subservient to the prospect. What I just said is real important. You have to be the leader. You have to be the doctor in the room. They have the problem. They're looking to buy real estate, sell real estate, uh, get information on real estate. Make sure you act like a professional and not like a little kid saying, Mommy, can I, can I have a cookie out of the jar? You won't get the respect. You'll get the rejection. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know when they talk back to you or talk down to you and they're giving those machine gun questions all the time? You're not going to make any money. You're just doing free consulting. You've got to take control. It's through your sales. Learning how to ask. There's two parts to the gut sales method. One of them is the psychology of asking questions, learning different uh, psychological triggers, how to do it. The next one is you've got to be a thespian. You've got to evoke sincerity. You've got to create a comfortable environment. You've got to act familiar. This takes practice and time. That's the only thing. If I can get you to make five phone calls a day and embrace and practice and learn and internalize the gut sales method, whew, life is so, will be so good for you. You will have a blank check in front of you the rest of your life. This is Claude Diamond, getting enthusiastic as always about sales. And, and it's not just real estate. For those of you in other businesses, it's the same principles. You've got to learn. you got to evoke empathy. What are they thinking? What are they feeling? What are the right words I can use so that I can go to the bank today? Because nobody, nobody deserves success more than you. I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. Give me a call. I answer my own phone. I won't bite. Oh, maybe once in a while. No, I'm kidding. I'm a friendly guy, but I get to the point, people, because time is money. Ask yourself this one question. 
how come some people, we all have 24 hours, how come some people can make as much money as they want, have a great life, go to bed and not worry about the damn cable bill or the rent or something? And most people are always concerned about money, always worried and sweating over money. What's the difference when we all have the same reasonable IQ, the same 24 hours in a day? What are those one percenters doing that maybe you're not doing? That's sales, the million dollar skill. Have a good day. Safe weekend too. Bye-bye.